Hi boys and girls, Teacher Paula here. I hope you guys are being safe and I sure do miss you guys. Uh, I have a story for you today that I'm going to tell and it's called Mole in a Hole and I hope you enjoy it. Mole in a Hole. Mole gives a groan. His home is too small. There's no room for me. Oh, no room at all. I'm not very tall, but I need a new place with trees and a view and plenty of space. He picks up his shovel and fixes his hat. In a big field, he starts to dig. Hey, Rabbit hops up. Stop, stop, Rabbit shouts. You're digging up my carrots. They're all popping out. Do you hear what I say? Don't dig, go away. Mole tries a new hole. He finds acorns galore. Not there, squirrel squeaks. That's my secret store. Do you hear what I say? Don't dig, go away. Mole tries a third time, near a hill by three trees. He sighs. All this digging is hard on my knees. I need a digger to make this hole bigger. He digs up old bowls. Boots and roots, sticks and stones. Then what does he see but enormous old bones? Mole slides down the sides to pick up the bones. What bad luck, Mole is stuck. He moans and he groans. If I had a ladder, I'd quickly be free. Mo looks at the bones and giggles with glee. He hooks them together. One, two, three. Hooray! Mole is out. Just look at the mess, shout Rabbit and Squirrel. You'll clean it up, right? I'll fix it right now. But how? Can you guess? Mole works away until it gets dark. Now everyone plays in Mole's Dinosaur Park. Yay! The end.